Madakin getting into it with Jaden Hart. Gloves are flying everywhere. Right at the benches. The rookie out of Surrey, BC, scored his first Western Hockey League goal a week ago against this Raider club. At the right point, Colby Williams takes a pass into the left corner for Connor Gay. Back to the line for Harrison. Snap shot, tipped, and they score! Quinn Christopher! And the Pats take the one to nothing lead. Nice little play here by the Pats. They drop it down to the low man and then kick it right back out to the point, and that gives them the opportunity. Brendan Gooley. Back to Leverton, right half full. Looking to the side net for Tkach, does. Try to shot, he scores. Tkach on the rebound. And we're tied to ones with 5.09 left in the first. Yeah, nice little play to the side of the goal. There was nobody there to handle the catch, so he just had free reign in front of Daniel Waffle. Through center for Wagner. Across the Raider blue line, sick handling, left wing pass for D'Amico, and he scores! Patrick D'Amico, what a goal! And the pass we take the lead to one. Gay at the hash marks. Off the boards to the left point for Harrison. Back into the left circle, Colton Croker. Croker in front for Christopher and he scores! Clayton Christopher is second of the night and it's 3-1! Perfect shot from Christopher right along the ice but what a feed from Colton Croker goes right across ice. And I'm not sure if he was trying to hit the man in the middle of the ice or if he was trying to hit Christopher the whole way. Rebound back of the net. Hart battling for it. Colby Williams takes it away. Leaves it behind the net for Cal Burles. Right wing pass off the stick of Conroy, but gets to the intended receiver, Padakin, who plays it up the left wing to center. And now we've got a fight. Cal Burles and Jaden Hart. They go crashing to the ice immediately as the linesman coming to break that up. Burles didn't like whatever Hart did. And behind the play must have been something with 12-21 left in the second. The Pats with a 3-1 lead. Underlying there for P8. Left side at the line, Underlick. Trying to pass again for Underlick. That's intercepted. D'Amico breakaway, shorthanded, shoots, and a blocker save from Nick McBride. D'Amico looking for his second of the game. So the Pat forwards with Hills and Dagger and Regan in the back end. The Raiders were able to clear the zone, turned it over. Brooks in the left circle, backhand shot, stopped. Rebound scores. Austin Wagner. And it's 4 1. What an unbelievable play by Adam Brooks to get that puck away, then get around one man, get around two, gets away a shot, thought he might bag that one, but couldn't get it by McBride, who's been excellent. Raiders on the puck in the offensive zone, Brendan Gooley, right half all for Leverton, back to Gooley at the blue line, slap shot off the post and he scores, Brendan Gooley hits the Raiders within two with a power play goal at 9.07 of this third period. Cross ice pass to catch in the slot. Gardner tried a one timer, but great play by D'Amico to stymie that. The Raiders keep the puck over to catch in front. Leverton tried to backhand it through his legs, but Wapple got down on the puck and covers. Not quite going yet as the Raiders get it deep. Williams pins his man back of the goal. Now McBride heads to the bench as Padakin takes over the puck in his own zone. Out to center for Dryden Hunt. Hunt will shoot for the empty goal and he scores. Dryden Hunt seals the victory. And it's 5 2. Oh, it felt great. I mean, the win's more important. Two goals comes of uh, from hard work from everybody. I mean, as a team, we wore them down from start to finish, and uh, you know we got scored on the power play, scored when we needed to, and, and kept the puck out of the net when we needed to. So I really have to give credit to my line mates. There, you got Adam Burks and Patty D'Amico working hard out there with me, and 
and I can't uh, can't take all the credit there. You know, I played well, but uh, those guys played even better. You know, I would say that they're probably the best players. Our line all together was probably the best line. I'd say, but you know, we had all four lines going tonight. There's no there's no best lines on that team. I'd say, you know, you have your fourth line playing your first line out there, and it's a lot different than last year. Uh, so, I wouldn't say that I was the best player. I'd say that every everybody was the best player out there tonight.